So let's review the project scope for the shopping cart. And this is going to be the first project. Uh, the user can add courses into the shopping cart. It's going to be one of the features of this project. And also the user can remove courses from the shopping cart. Also, the shopping cart content is going to be saved into local storage. Uh, this is going to be really nice because uh, saving this in the local storage, the user can uh, reload the page and everything is going to be there because it's saved into the storage. The shopping cart is going to display the contents from the local storage when the page loads. And finally, when a course is removed from the shopping cart, it's going to be uh, removed also from local storage. So let's review the project. This is going to be the interface for this project. You can see we have some courses right here. We're gonna, for example, I'm gonna select this HTML5, CSS3, JavaScript for beginners. We're gonna click here on Add to Cart. And I'm gonna uh, select this one also, in Guitar for Beginners. So we're gonna select two courses into the shopping cart. Then the shopping cart, I'm gonna scroll to the top. And here you can see that we have these two courses into the cart. So I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna reload this. And these courses are going to be saved into the local storage. So once the user comes back to this website and opens the, the cart, the elements are going to be here. And the user is going to be able to remove one of these. So you can remove this and again reload. And you can see that we have this in the local storage. So we can add another course. And you can see we have another course. So reload again. And you can see that we have the courses saved into the storage. So this is a really nice project. And this is going to be the first project of this course. And with this project, you are going to learn the basics of DOM scripting and also local storage.